All right, boys, I have a question. Go I want to know, is there any anime out there that you, you know, maybe have a hot take on, like an anime that you think is either really good, uh, an anime that you like that is highly praised and widely accepted to be amazing that you think isn't that good? Mm. Or is there a show that everyone thinks shit that you think is pretty good? Mm. Jerry's already had his with fucking school days. <laughs> Cuz, you know, I really like the Cowboy Bebop dub, but I, the show itself, like, I didn't think it was like that good. I'm going to be honest. Like, I liked it. I liked it but Ooh. I didn't think it was like the masterpiece worthy. Like everyone says it's like- I, I, I hate that I can't disagree with you. Like it's- Like it's- Like the, the dub- I, the I preferred I'm, Samurai Champloo a million yes, times yes, more. Yes, yes, yes. Nah, nah, you're, million you're, you're times more. I was, I, I was about to say, I have exactly the same opinion, just with Samurai Champloo. No! no. Samurai, <laughs> Samurai Champloo was a million to times me, better. To me, like, this, like I, I, I don't know what it was about Samurai Champloo. I thought the story, the style, every, the music was like amazing. Mm. And the music gets amazing in Cowboy Bebop, but don't get me wrong. Yeah. But like the reasons why I liked Cowboy Bebop was well, one, the dub, and two, nothing to do with the story. I thought the story was kind of like, all right, okay. I just I just feel like Cowboy Bebop had some really interesting ideas because it's it's kind of like, Cowboy Bebop is, isn't like a long, like it doesn't have like a very long overarching story arc. Mm. It's more of these individual ideas that, you know, that Wantanabe wanted to explore. And I thought it had some really good ideas and so did Samurai Champloo, mm. but I don't know, something about Samurai Champloo just made me feel like, the ideas just weren't as interesting oh. on an individual level. Like, can no. you can you sit here and, and like say to me that Cowboy Bebop deserves to be like in the top five as it always is on every single Yes. Group? Really? Yes. Really top five? I t okay. Like when I see it- Like I, of all time. Like when I see it, it's like those people who put Citizen Kane at number one on movie. It's like, <laughs> it's like yeah, I know movies. Citizen Kane's my favorite. I know the movie. Oh uh, yes, <laughs> Rosebud, my favorite quote. Right. It's like, it's like I, when I see that on someone's like top five, yeah. I immediately think they're like trying too hard to be a critic. Because yeah, yeah. to me, I, again, I, I don't think of anime in like a critical sense I guess yeah. most of the time. I just thought when I watched it, I was like, it's really fucking cool. Tons of style. I just thought the story was kind of meh. Mm. Yeah, I mean, if you, go, if you go into it for like a big story, then it's- Just as a show. Okay, so, <laughs> well, okay, so what about the Samurai Champloo story was good then? I, okay, this has been a long time since I watched both. But, yeah, same here, same here. But I don't know. I remember just really having fucking a ton of fun every single episode of Samurai. To me, to me, the story and like character, like how much I enjoyed the story and the characters of both Samurai Champloo and Cowboy Bebop were around equal. Yeah, it was I, everything I, yeah. else around the show, like the music, the soundtrack, Didn't like the effects, to. like the animation stuff yeah. that made Samurai Champloo just that much better. I mean, like, I, I, I did not give a fuck about the fucking annoying kid on Cowboy Bebop. I, I mean, didn't, I, I didn't give a fuck about Fu. Yeah, for like, for like what, what, what were they trying to do again? Finding the finding samurai, the samurai that, smells that smells like, like sunflowers. sunflowers. Like no. the plot doesn't matter in either fucking show. No, I, I just, Let's I like the characters more in Samurai Shampoo as well, honestly. I agree. Like I thought because we had only three of them, it was like, we got a lot more time to like flesh it <laughs> out. Whereas they just brought this fucking sidekick character and a dog and I'm like, why? Okay, to be fair, I love Ayn though. Yeah, <laughs> yeah he's Ayn. Ayn is, Ayn Ayn is great. Ayn is dope. Spike, Spike is like one of the coolest anime characters of all time. Jet I think Mugen was cooler to be honest with you. <laughs> just saying, I think Mugen was way cooler than Spike. I think Spike is dope, but if I had to like say which one was cooler, definitely Mugen was Yeah, cool. but Spike can meet, Spike can beat Mugen. Oh my fucking God. <laughs> my dad works for Microsoft. <laughs> yeah, but Spike be able to survive AIDS? My, my, my character can beat up your character. Have you thought about that? What's oh Mugen God. gonna do? Swing his samurai sword? Mike, uh, Spike can just fucking shoot him, man. <laughs> My, where's Mike? Mike like Spiegel. <laughs> Fuck, where's Mike? I mean, I don't know. I, I, no, I, I Cowboy just, Bebop has been one of those shows that mm. I do think is great, mm. but it's just whenever I see it in top fives, I'm like, you're just shouting out of your ass. Like, yeah.